going through the dark woods. But the dark woods are so dark. That's okay. Your ghost scaring machine has all kinds of lights on it. Yeah. I guess it's one last adventure for the ghost scaring machine. And this could be the biggest adventure of all. This fog is pretty spooky. Eh, I'm not scared. <laughs> Me neither, but I do like to see where I'm going. Percy, would your radar dish help? <gasps> Absolutely. Activating. Yeah, there's something big ahead. Like how big? Like ghost big? Ah! Ghost! Uh, I'm pretty sure that's not a ghost. Hi, guys. What are you doing? I got turned around in the fog. And I can't see past my bumper. And it seems like it's getting worse. We've got to find our way out of the dark woods. I don't want to miss what they found up on Lookout Mountain. Oh, I just wish we could see through the fog. Wait, my night vision goggles can see through darkness and fog. I'll lead the way. What do you see, Percy? Huh? Stop! Phew! I'm glad we didn't run full steam into that. But we need to move it somehow. Yeah. Does your machine have a Carly in it? No. But it does have a grappling hook. Yes, it does. Now, if everyone can hook together and help me pull, I think we can move this. You heard him. Now, pull! Wow. I mean, not bad. Yeah. The ghost hearing machine is full of surprises. Come on, guys. Let's get moving. Woo! We're out. Great. First one to look out mountain wins. We're all in Muddy. <laughs> we're winning! Oh, doesn't that feel right? You were winning, but now it's not ya, cause we got ya! <laughs> go! Go, 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 go! Can you put on more steam? Those guys are gaining on us! That's right, we're gaining! Come on, pal, you're a diesel. Name's Diesel. You can do it. I'm bigger and stronger any day. Ah, bolts! Don't worry. He may be stronger, but I'm more nimble. That means quicker! <gasps> Thomas! That was a dangerous curve's ahead sign back there! Ha! Oldest trick in the book. Just ignore him. It's okay. This is where being quicker comes in handy. Did you hear that? I hope they're okay. They're fine, but we're a million miles behind. We need to go faster. Hold on. Uh-oh. Uh, Diesel. You didn't loosen a wheel just now, did you? Maybe, but it's okay. I have lots more. Do you see them? Are they coming? Oh, there they go. Way too fast. Come on, Diesel. I got a lug nut riding on this. Thought you could lose me on the curves, huh? We did lose you. Yeah, we're almost there. Watch this. Go, Diesel! We're gonna win! Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Don't worry about
about them. That's the second oldest trick in the book. It wasn't a trick. We're going back. But we're almost at the finish line. Why? Why? Diesel! Are you okay? Yeah, but I'm gonna need a new wheel. <sighs> I knew it was loose, but I didn't want to lose. Now I lost a wheel and the race, too. We always race, but it wasn't fun this time. Why not? Maybe it's because you were cheating. Cheating? Me? <laughs> That's ridiculous. Hmm, Diesel derailed. Looks like you owe me a lug nut. <sighs> Is this it? Nope. How about this? Nope. This one. Thomas, that's an old bucket. Sorry, Diesel. I just don't see any more. Hey, guys. You here to pick up recyclables for Bullstrode 2? Race you to Brendam Docks, but you know I'll win. <laughs> Connor's got Rusty. You'd better catch up to her before she makes that delivery. Then let's quit slugging and get chugging, Thomas. Catch you back in the sheds, Percy. <laughs> Looks like Bullstrode's getting ready to leave. Oh, no. Hurry! There you are. Told you I'd win. Hey, where's your cargo? Connor, where are the cans? The cans? Oh, no. I dropped them off to Bullstrode, and he just left. Uh, this just keeps happening. We'll never get Rusty back now. I made you a Thomas promise, and I'm going to keep it. <laughs> What's going on? <gasps> okay, that was pretty impressive for a chimney head. Yeah, no. Oh. <gasps> Got it! My can! You found it! Oh, Rusty, I missed you. And now that you're back, everything is... Uh, that's not my can. What? Of course it is. It's got a rusty spot, just like yours, see? This can has a rusty spot on the bottom. My can has a rusty spot on the top. They're totally different. How? Both rusty cans and... Diesel, wait! Diesel, wait up! I don't get it. Why is this so important to you? That can is crusty and old, kind of creaky and cold. No, it can't hold your hand, and it's not made of gold. It ain't much of a talker, and it can't sit or stand. Why do you love that rusty can? He may be squeaky and loud, and he can't race around. But if you tell him a secret, he won't make a sound. No, he won't hug you back, but he'll stay till the end. Oh, man, I love my rusty can. Bum, 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 bum. He's a thin piece of tin. He's a bucket of junk. He's so icky and sticky and full of gunk. But he means so much more to me than I ever um, planned. Oh, man, I love my rusty can. That's right. Oh, man, I miss my rusty can. I see why you miss your rusty can. All right, team. Put your axles into it. As soon as we fill Pumpkin Station, it'll be time for hay rides. Thomas, Annie and Clarabelle should be loaded with passengers and ready to go. Why don't you go pick them up from Knapford? You got it. You want to come with me? Absolutely. <laughs> the passengers sound excited for the hay ride. They certainly do. They can't wait for the hay ride. See, it doesn't matter what season it is if people are having fun. Yeah, the passengers are pretty happy. <gasps> Whoa! The pumpkin station is trinktastic! Come on, let's go. <laughs> this does feel as fun as a day at the beach. Told ya. Pumpkin Station looks gorgeous. Good job, everyone. All that's left to do now are the hay rides. Sparking! I wish I was pulling one of those hay carts, but since you don't need me, 
I guess we'll be heading back to the sheds. <sighs> if only there was something more for him to do. I know! Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Fall Festival. Let the hay rides begin! Yeah. Oh, no. My coupler seems to be acting up. I can't tow the hayride. <gasps> Yay! Yeah! I mean, no. Oh, no. But Gordon's coupler's fine. <laughs> oh, this is terrible. If Gordon can't tow the hayride, what will we do? All oh, those happy passengers will be so disappointed. Never fear. <laughs> Thomas can do it. I can? He can? Certainly. Would you fill in for me, Thomas? Yeah, Thomas. Hook up. Well, I wouldn't want anyone missing out on a hayride. That's the spirit, number one. <laughs> Have a good well, time! Enjoy yourself. So, are you still missing summer? Nope. You showed me how great fall is. Laying in the leaves, the colors, all the happy people. It's been an unbelievable day. I am so late. Hey, I think this could be a shortcut up here. This is great. I wonder why I've never gone this way before. Now we're back on track, and I'm not gonna miss a thing. Mia, this is a one-way track! <gasps> oh, no! ah! oh, James. I must have missed the sign. We have beach balls, Nia. Bouncy, bouncy beach balls. How am I ever going to find them all? I'm so sorry, James. I was just trying to stick to my plan. Oh, well, accidents happen. If anyone can handle it, I'm sure I can. Hey, look. Is that a beach ball? And Mia. Hey, Mia, what happened? <sighs> I had to go the long way, but I went the wrong way instead. Because of the cows? I heard some cows caused a traffic jam at Wellsworth, and it messed up traffic all over the island. How are your deliveries going? One, I didn't get to see Bitsy frolicking at McCall's farm. Two, I didn't get to see the palm trees swaying at Norrinby Beach. And three, I'm gonna miss the concert in Vickerstown. Thanks to me, there's not even gonna be a sunset concert in Vickerstown. Well, you can't do everything. Thanks to my plan, I'm not gonna get to do anything, and nothing is gonna get delivered. It's good to have a plan, but maybe you just tried to do too much? That's true. I did try to do too much. So now we need a new plan, a not too much plan. But I might need your help. Sure, tell us what to do. We're, We're in. in. Okay, Thomas, you need to get these palm trees to Normby Beach. But the track is still closed because of that traffic jam. That's okay if you're up for adventure. You're gonna go by water. Uh, Nia, Thomas may be amazing, but he can't swim. No, but Bostrode can. Awesome! I can't wait to see how they look. Kana, this piano needs to be in Vickerstown before sunset. Can you do it? With my speed, it'll be a breeze. And I'll take the cows to McCall's because that's the one thing I wanted to see the most. Percy, can you find which way is the least crowded? Can do. Now this is a plan that's gonna work. Those palm trees will be beautiful. Thanks for the ride, Bullstrode. My pleasure, Thomas. This isn't so bad. Four more packages to deliver. We'll be back at Tidmouth Sheds in no time. Yeah. Uh-huh. No time. Right. Uh, Percy, we're gonna get through this together. And you can't keep an eye out for scary stuff if your eyes are closed. Okay. Okay. Look! There 
is nothing scary on these tracks. Uh, not scary dancing tree. Not scary water tower. You try. Okay. Not scary fence. Not scary moon. Not scary shadow monster. <laughs> shadow monster? Ah! Huh? Oh! <laughs> That's not a shadow monster. It's just the shadow from a jack-o'-lantern. You're right. <laughs> Whoa. What? What's that? Uh, probably nothing, I think. Come on. <laughs> it's only that squeaky weather vane. Oh, it scares me every time. <laughs> Happy Halloween, Mr. Weather Vane! <laughs> the cow's so spooked. I can't see anything in all this mist. I don't see anything. But come on, two more deliveries to go. Whiff's recycling, then bring them dogs. <laughs> Package delivered. One more job to go. Well. It's a monster claw! Wait, actually, I don't know what it is. That's not a monster's claw. It's a bunch of old rails! <laughs> wow! So far, a lot of what we've seen isn't so scary close up. <laughs> this is fun. I'm glad I didn't hide in my shed. The night was way scarier in my head. That's Halloween for you. Pure, get the chill, silly kind of fun. Yeah, like that ghost train behind us. It's just a... Wait, ghost, ghost train? train? Ah! Ghost scaring machine, engage! see anything. He must be too far out. Cranky, can you see him? Looking and looking and nope. Nothing. What are we gonna do? <gasps> Harold! Can you help us? He's not hearing us. Cranky, could you lift me up so he can hear? Whoa, oh, so high. Harold! Harold! Diesel and I were playing hide and surprise, and I think he might be stuck on a barge out at sea. Can you help us find him? 10-4, that's a pilot speak for okay. <laughs> Operation Find Your Friend Diesel is a go. Thanks, Harold! Uh, Cranky, do you think you could let me down now? <laughs> to get off this... <laughs> if I wasn't so worried about winning the game, I wouldn't be stuck on this silly barge. Now, I'll probably never get a chance to beat anyone at anything ever again. Hey, you squawked for your friends. That might work. I can... For mine. Okay, they'll hear me. Any minute now. Any minute. Maybe I'm too far away for them to hear me? I've got to get them to see me somehow. <gasps> Look! Those seagulls! There's the barge! That must be where Diesel is. It's Harold. Harold! I'm over here! Ahoy, Diesel. Heard you could use some help. 
Bingo. Now for step two. You can start pulling any time, Harold. I was, but this barge is really heavy. Ah, broken blades. We're gonna need a new approach for Operation Rescue Diesel. But you can do something, right? I don't want to be stuck on this barge forever. Not to worry, friend. Help is on the way. Bullstrode! I got it from here, Harold. 